Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening, man. How y'all doing? Who's on here? Shout out to Jesse James. What's up, Morris? What's up, bro? Shout out to Sammy Moreno. Shout out to Sal, man. We got... What's up, y'all? What y'all doing, man? So today, man, we're having a show today, man. We're going to have a show. Shout out to... Philadelphia, Philadelphia, Philadelphia. I can't say that word. Trying to though. But what's up, man? Shout out to Joe. Shout out to all of y'all, man. So speaking of Joe, man, I'm gonna be over there doing uh his wife's benefit, man. I'm doing a, a benefit. They raising, trying to raise money for a bunch of hospital bills. It's really bad, man. But awesome people, really, really awesome people. So I'll be over there, and that'll be going down the 24th. And uh, he could post that. He could post it up on there. But uh, the flower will be coming out soon. So today's show, man, is don't be afraid to start all over again. Sometimes a clean slate is what we all need. And 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 that's true, man, because some people, like I, I was talking to some people today and I said, man, you know what? I was doing the keto lifestyle and everything was great. And then I fell off, man. I don't even know how to, uh, to go back to it. So you know what? Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. The thing, the good thing about it is just get back on it, man. And I'm here to help you, you know. And it's on anything, man. It's on sometimes you got to leave a job to get a better job, you know. Um, sometimes we got to leave that comfortable position to get a better position, you know, no matter what it is, you know. So that's why today's topic is don't be afraid to start all over again. Sometimes a clean slate is what we need. And the reason why I put 96 next to it is because this is my 96th live video, my 96th live show. 96th live show. So pretty soon we're going to be at 100 and we're going to go ahead and celebrate. I'm going to give out some stuff. It's like, shout out to Matt, man. So pretty soon we're going to say, what's up, man? Where you coming in from? Let me know where you're coming from. We're also on Instagram over here. And on Instagram, man, um, my new page is sugar. Uh, one sugar is the devil. One sugar is the devil. That's my Instagram page. And of course, you can still find me on DJ Freestyles on the page. But put on there. Let me know where you're coming from. So shout out to Susan, man. So let me know where you're coming in from. So if y'all in Houston, put Houston. If y'all in San Antonio, put San Antonio. If you're in Second Ward, put Second Ward. Wherever you're at, Denver Harbor, downtown, wherever you're at right now, please put that for me. That helps my ratings and that helps um, me to be able to add more people on here. So a lot of times, man, shout out to Greg, man. What's up? Shout out to Greg, man. Shout out, you know, I just did an event for them, so shout out to them. Um, a lot of times, man, we're afraid to start over. You know, we, we're just afraid to start all over again. No matter what it is, you know, we get comfortable and we're like, man, you know what? I'm going to stay like this because it's so simple. It's easy. And sometimes the fear you have to start all over again is like, man, where, how am I going to start from the bottom? But honestly, I remember one time that I started all over again and I started from the bottom. And now I'm more on top than what I was back then, you know? And, and sometimes it just happens that way. Sometimes we, we have to lose everything to gain more from it, you know? And, and I'm not just talking about money. I'm talking about anything, you know? Sometimes we're at this job and, and, and we're getting paid this much money. We, give, we could be getting paid more money, right? But we're afraid. We don't want to do that, you know? And the same thing with your health. You know, sometimes you're like, man, you know what? I've done this, to my, I done this before and it didn't help me, but... The thing is, don't be afraid to start all over again because sometimes you didn't have the admission. You, I mean, not the admission. You didn't have the, 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 um, the fight power that you have now that you could have now. So maybe a while back, maybe a couple of years ago, you wanted to do the keto lifestyle, but you couldn't do it. Why? Because you had nobody to help you out. Well, guess what? I'm here to help you out, you know, and it, it could be in anything, you know. There's nothing wrong with starting all over again, you know. The main thing is that we can start all over again, you know. Nobody's going to stop us from starting all over again. And, again, it doesn't matter if you're trying to drop weight, if it's about your health, if it's about a job. You know, you might, you might want to start all over by getting a, a new house, you know, and, and you feel like, man, you know what, I don't even want to go through that. And, and sometimes you have to. Sometimes you have to start all over, go with a clean slate, and then you just go harder with it, you know, go harder with it. Shout out to Jessica Jeans, man. She's 
I think she said she's 300, 350 or 300 from hitting 10,000 on her Instagram, 10,000. So y'all make sure y'all go hit up her Instagram, uh, uh, Hustle Vida. Uh, Hustle, uh, no, uh, it's um, a Hustle Network, right? Go ahead, and, go ahead and put it on there for me, Jessica. Put it on there for me and, and let everybody know to go over there and, and add so you can get your 100, 350 people up there or whatever the amount is. So you get 10,000, man. I'll be happy if I hit a thousand people on my Instagram. I don't got a thousand people yet, you know, almost there, but not yet. But uh, shout out to Maria, shout out to Jessica, man. Shout out to all of them. They're all doing wonderful things, uh, especially Jessica. Uh, appreciate her coming on the show and stuff. And, and maybe she wants to start all over again. Maybe, maybe she fell off and she wants to start all over again. And that's why, you know, you can, you can start all over again. No, what's up, Instagram over here on Instagram? We some people on Instagram. What's up, y'all? And make sure y'all go add my, my other Instagram, uh, Sugar is the uh, One, Sugar is the Devil. So if you're ready to come down here, today's my 96th, my 96th show, 96. And at one time, I just did a show because I was happy about how much weight I lost and how I felt about my health. And they were hitting me up and telling me, hey, when's your next, when's your next uh, uh, live video? And I was like, oh, man, what am I going to do on their DJ? Because I was not ready for it, you know, but. Since the great by the grace of God, man, I've been this is my 96th show, and I've been helping so many people. I think I've, I've helped already like 24 or 25 people. Um, I've helped people, I've helped um, people drop 80 pounds. I helped somebody drop 80 pounds. Uh, somebody said they're at 75 pounds, and, and uh, unfortunately, uh, fortunately, guys lose weight faster than women do, it just happens that way. But don't get discouraged because women, you will drop weight. If you listen to me, you follow what I tell you, you will drop weight. Uh, you drop a lot of inches, you know, and that's just the way it is. Guys just lo lose weight faster. So these guys are losing weight. Anna's probably, I'll say Anna's probably maybe at 25 to 30 pounds already, maybe more, if I'm not mistaken, around there. And then there's more people that, um, and then, then I got some new people that jumped on. Uh, actually, my niece, um, she got pregnant. She just had her twins. And she told me the day she wants to get back on the keto lifestyle. So I said, let's do it, you know. So she's going to be on here. She's joining us today, Tracy, or she's going to be on here in a little bit. Uh, shout out to Jose, man. Shout out to Jose, awesome person. Uh, shout out to Elizabeth, man. Um, so I, I met up with her today. I actually met her at, at um, Kroger's. She works at Kroger's and she works at place, but she also does the the, the oil. What is, I'm not sure what it's called, but I'm real interested. in man, I haven't did my research on it and everything, but I've just been hearing a lot about it, a lot about it. So you never know, man. It might be something that I'm going to want all the people that I'm coaching and everybody. And just even if you're not doing the keto lifestyle, I heard this thing's amazing. It's really amazing. And I don't have that flyer with me, but I, I will get that to everybody out here if, if they want to do that. Because I heard the oil is really awesome. And I really want, I actually want to use it for my son because my son has ADD and uh, he, he has some type of, uh, um, uh, what is it called? Um, Man, I don't know. It'll come to me right now. Shout out to Veronica, man. Shout out to Pete. Shout out to all y'all. Pete, awesome DJ, man. Um, if you need a, a photo booth, they do all the photo booth and everything like that. But guys, where you're coming in from, man, let me know where you're coming in from. So if y'all coming in from Houston, put Houston. If you're coming in from out of town, put out of town. And if you feel amazing, man, I'm happy for you, man, because that's the way I feel. Uh, y'all, y'all do know. I let y'all know that my um my stepfather my stepfather lost the battle of cancer. Uh, he lost it actually last Monday. And uh, we just, uh, he's get, he's going to get cremated. But my mom, I called my mom today and my mom was more calm. You know, my mom was more calm. And in some of the things she said, what I wanted, what I've been wanting to hear, she said, you know what? He was suffering really, really bad. And I said, yeah, he really was. And she goes, I'm, I'm happy. I'm grateful that he's not suffering no more. And I said, so am I. She goes, it hurts, but we know he's not suffering no more. And I mean, how can we be selfish and, and, and say, you know, yeah, this is called CBD oil. Yeah. So how can we be selfish and want somebody to live in misery, want somebody to live by suffering? We don't want that. I wouldn't want that for myself. I wouldn't want that for my worst enemy, you know. But man, cancer is cancer the mother, you know. It, it's just it's terrible. It's terrible, man. And, and and shout out to Melva, man. Shout out to Melva. Shout out to Herberto, man. Um I was going to try this food last time, but they ran out. They sold out. So speaking of sold out, so 
we're getting ready to be at the farmer's market. We're going to be at the farmer's market. I'm not sure which one. We're going to be in a, a few of them, but we're going to be at the farmer's market. And uh, it's just time. I, we did. We did. We sold out at Fitness Connection. We sold out at Fitness Connection. And um, it, it's awesome, man. It's an awesome feeling. And speaking of awesome feeling, look at this right here. I'm going to have to do it to y'all today again. Look at this. Look at this. So. My wife, she likes the the cups, the Reese's cups. Is that what, what is that what they call the Reese's cups? So I said, I'm gonna try to make a cookie, a Reese's cookie, right? A Reese's cup cookie, whatever you want to call it. And man, this is so good. You know, it it, it passed everything I make passes my expectations, but it's because I take my time, and if it's not right, I throw it away or I just don't use it no more. And uh, it has to be very low on net carbs, and it has to be very delicious, very, very good. And I'm going to eat this in front of y'all. Don't think I'm not. I'm going to eat this in front of y'all. And it's good. I just want to show y'all. Look. I just want to show you. Look Look at this. Look at, the, look at the inside of this. Look at the inside of this. Let me back up a little bit. Let me show y'all real quick. Let me show you the inside of this. So delicious. I mean, it's just really, really delicious. So I got your treats. You know, I talked to somebody today and they said, man, you know what? I, 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 can, do, I can do the keto lifestyle, man, but I love sweets. I love sweets. I said, guess what? I got your sweets. You can order them now. You can order them now. Matter of fact, I'm doing a banana bread right now. And um, that's getting done in the oven right now. And uh, man, so they ordered some banana bread. And, and you know, you go to my store, um, my online uh, store, which is sugaristhedevil.net. Sugaristhedevil.net. And man, you know, I'm always happy. I'm always feeling amazing, man. I feel really good. You know, I feel really, really, really good, man. You know, really good. I shout out to Frank, man. So I feel really good. But guys, man, you know, let's talk, man. Let's interact. We got to interact on here. We have to, you know, because what, what it is, is that later on, I want to see what we talked about. And if you have any questions, don't be afraid to ask me questions. Ask me the questions right now is the time to ask me the questions right now. You know, and if I can't answer them, I'll Google them. Or most of the time when we're talking about keto, we're talking about this, then I'm able to answer them, you know. But if not, again, I, I, I can Google them. I can look them up, and I'll do all the research for you. But um, shout out to Shannon. Shout out to Agape. Agape was that Agape 1? Yeah, it gave one. So um, shout out to y'all. So, yeah, man, so – you know, all of us, all of us sometimes feel, man, you know what? I can't do that, man. I don't want to start all over. Nah, you know what? I've been at this job for 12 years, 13 years. I don't want to start all over. But sometimes starting all over is going to get you at a bigger spot, get you at a bigger position, get you at a bigger place. You know, it, it might not be the same, but it's going to put you at a bigger position. You know, you're going to, you're going to, you can't just stay there. You know, a, a friend of mine told me a while back, never settle. And I never knew what that was about, right? But now I do. So never settle. And I ran with it. And I've been running with it for years, for years, for years, because I don't settle. You know, I, I don't put myself in a comfortable position. And if I do put myself in a comfortable position, it's because I'm really comfortable. It's because I got this business running. I got this business running. I'm helping this person. I'm helping this person. I'm helping this person. And I'm doing a lot of things to help people. Shout out to Sharita. And, and we were just talking about that. So Sharita is somebody I was coaching. And um, she said that she fell off, that she really fell off. But she's, she went to go buy some stuff. She's back on it, you know. And, and that's the thing about it, you know. I never told y'all this was going to be easy. I, I don't lie to people. I don't ever tell y'all it's going to be easy because it's not easy. It's not easy, you know, it, but it's what you want. It's what you want out of it, you know. Now, say Sharita wouldn't have fell off, then she would have dropped more weight, you know, she, and it's not so much the weight, it's your health. It's always how your health feels, you know, it's always how your health feels. And I tell you, I don't even get headaches, you know. I, I do take that back. I got a headache during the time I was going to the to the to the rosary and stuff like that. I probably got a headache because I was just so, you know, you get into that position, right? But I'm good now. I'm, I'm feeling amazing. It was not no headache where I had to take pills or take aspirin or anything. It's never been like that. But I'm about to eat this cookie in front of y'all. So check this out. Here we go. Look at this. 3D. Here we go. 
Mm. When I tell you the little gold with the little gold around them, when I tell you that, they're so good. I didn't even know what the name them. I said they're gonna be Reese's Cups cookies or Reese's cookies, but they're good. They're to me they're better, you know. They're good. So shout out to Grimes, man, Mr. Grimes. Shout out to Daryl. What's up, man? So, man. They're so good. And they're doing exactly what I want them to do. I wanted them to be a little bit firm, but a little bit soft. You know, I want people to enjoy it. And this right here is going to be in, in sugarthedevil.net real soon. I still got to figure out the net carbs on this. I want to get them exactly. But if I'm not mistaken, we're probably looking at 1.6 net carbs or something like that. So very, very little bit net carbs. but. How y'all been, man? Talk to me. Instagram, talk to me. Facebook, can I help you in any kind of way? Can I help you in any kind of way? And look, I'm a man of all trades, man. I'm a man of all trades. Right now, I'm working on somebody's logo. I'm working on somebody's flyer for the Pasadena cook-off coming up. I am working on on DJing in Sugarland this Saturday. Uh, Friday, I don't know where I'm be at yet. Uh, most of the time in Moonlights, but... I'm just everywhere. I'm DJing. So I'm DJing. I'm baking. I, I'm helping people with their business. I'm doing graphics, flyers. Oh my God. Thank God for keeping me busy, for keeping me blessed, you know? So shout out to Gloria. Gloria, how you doing, Gloria? Let me know how much weight have you lost? Have we stayed on have we stayed on it, Gloria? That's what I want to know. Have we stayed on it? So if you fell off, let me know. I just want to know, but I'm pretty sure you've been good. Um, and guys, it's really easy to fall off, to fall off our focus. You know, sometimes we might go through something in our family. It could have been me. I could have went through it during the time that I went to the rosary, that I went to this, that I went to that, man, there was food all over the place. And my family was like, you're going to be okay for a couple of days. You're going to be okay. And I say, I'm already okay. I'm good. I don't need that. I don't need that. You know, they had ham sandwich. Guess what I was doing? I was taking the ham, the cheese out, and throwing the bread to the side and eating the ham and cheese. Or they had them in croissants or whatever it is. But I was eating the ham and cheese, and I was getting full, and I was good. And I was good because I don't work this hard. Hey there, I have lost 16 pounds. Yes, 16 pounds. Gloria, when did I start coaching you? When did we have that talk? When did I start coaching you? Do you remember? Because I don't have it in front of me. What's up, Louis? What's up, Lou? Shout out to Lou, man. Lou looks good out there. Sarah Padilla, man. Shout out to her, man. We're going to be doing some things together. Um, That's your meal prep right there. She does all the meal preps. And they're affordable. And I heard they're real delicious. And that's from people that I'm coaching. So shout out to them. Shout out to her, man. Yes, we have. Awesome. 16 pounds. And my sugar levels are good. You know what? If you keep it up, you're no longer going to be diabetic. You probably, maybe not even there yet. What are your numbers looking like in the morning? What are your numbers looking like in the morning? Let me know what your numbers are looking like in the morning. Okay, so what is the keto lifestyle? What is the keto lifestyle good for? Everything. Everything. You got diabetes. Bam, keto is going to take care of that. You got high blood pressure. Bam, keto is going to take care of that. You got anxiety, keto's going to take care of that. Depression, keto's going to take care of that. And it keeps on going and going, and keto's going to take care of that. Keto's gonna, why? Because when you're on the keto lifestyle, you're constantly deleting sugar from your life. You're already doing it. So I put sugar is the devil all the time. Sugar is the devil. Sugar is the devil. Why? Because it is. So it falls into the same place. Okay. So 110 to 114. Hmm, I'm not sure what that is. Is that the date? No, that can't be the date. I'm not sure. So, oh, my wife's on here. Look, babe, I'm telling about the cookies. The cookies. Oh, the cookies. Man, if I could only taste this. Shout out to Marie Simon Miguel. 
Shout out. Linda, what's up? Linda, how you doing? So Linda ain't been over here, but she's going to be coming over here soon to pick up her um, treats. Because I got them. And oh my God, that banana bread is amazing. Speaking of the banana bread, Lydia. Lydia. Make sure my banana bread don't burn. Thank you, babe. It's in the oven right now. Oh, she said you better not be eating eat, eat all my cookies. <laughs> no, I just ate, I'm just eating two. Shout out to Melissa. Um, yeah, I made these for my wife. They're good. Oh, mm, mm, mm. so delicious. So so good. If y'all ain't visit sugarsthedevil.net, y'all need to hurry up and do that. Plus. That's going to help you out from cheating. A lot of times people say, I don't have a sweet tooth, right? You say they, they say they don't, right? Well, the same people, once you stop taking in that sugar, once you start doing the keto lifestyle, you're going to start craving something sweet. You are. Because your body never wanted it before, but now your body wants it. And when that happens, bam, I got your treats. Okay, so, hey, Gilbert, that great news. I have a new client that messaged me today. He has down 11 pounds eating Sarita's, uh, Sarita's, uh, Sarita's uh, meal prep. So that's awesome because it's it's true what she says because it's all what you put in your, your, your stomach. It's what you take. It's what you take in, you know? And some people say, well, I can make my own food. That's not true. Sometimes you're too busy to make your own food. Sometimes you don't even know how to make your food, you know? I, I, I know. I know how. And I could tell you. And you could look up on the internet and you could look up this. But sometimes you can't follow everything the internet says, you know? So not, why, why not go with somebody that specializes in that, which that's what Sarah does, right? So they tell me, Free, why don't you do meal prep? Why don't you do meal prep? I say, oh, I couldn't do it if I wanted to. I'm so busy. What I'm focusing on right now is getting the treats out to y'all, getting the treats out to y'all. The reason why I made sugaristhedevil.net, my, my sugar, the bakery, healthy, low-carb keto treats, because I didn't want y'all to cheat. I didn't want y'all to have no excuses. I don't want y'all to say, you know what, Free's helping me, he's coaching me, we're doing this, but man, you know what, I ate that donut because I had to have it. I had to have a donut. No, I want you to say, Free's coaching me, I'm dropping weight, my health is better, I'm no longer diabetic. I know I'm no I don't have no high blood pressure no more. This doesn't hurt me no more. I got more energy. That's what I want to hear. And I want you to hear, and you know what? I get my treats from him. I don't got to worry about cheating because he has stuff that tastes so good. You know? Shout out to Rachel. How you doing, Rachel? Shout out to Juanita. What's up? Um, so yeah, guys, man, you know what? Don't be afraid to start all over again. Sometimes a clean slate is what we need. And today is Remember When Wednesday. Remember when I would never get this size again. So I'm going to show y'all a picture of me. Let me look for one real quick. Maybe I even got one of my wife. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see what I got on here. Because I keep these pictures. So. Okay, okay. I got one of me and my wife. I got one of me and my wife. Check this one out, y'all guys. So look at this. Remember when I would never look like this again. Check it out. Picture of me and my wife. So there you get one of me and my wife. Let me try to get closer. Look at that. I like a Samoa. Oh, see, look. Okay, so it's just because it, it's it's going too many different ways. Here we go. Here we go. Look at that. I've been there. We do this together. We do this together, guys. We do this together. You do not do it alone. I've been there. When I tell you something, it's because I've been there. I don't feel sorry for people. I'm here to do these shows 
because I care about a lot of people because God put me in this position because he helped me out because I didn't have nobody to help me. I never had nobody that I can watch videos with that somebody can help me and everything. I never had that before. I never, never had that before. Right. And you got to excuse me because I'm, I'm detoxing right now. It's not that I want to. It's just that my tea does that. My tea, you know, helps detox and stuff. And if you ain't picked up my tea, man, what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? My tea, I've been hearing stories about, like, man, it's giving me so much energy. It's helping me with this. It helped me. I mean, it's just helping people with a lot, especially weight, especially it just makes you feel good. It's really good tea. So you can pick that up. You can pick that up. Shout out to David, man. Shout out to David on here. And shout out to everybody on here. Appreciate everybody on here. Man, hey, ask me some questions, babe. And look, I'm about to eat one more cookie. I'm about to eat one more cookie. She said, these are my cookies. I did make them for her because she likes the, the Reese's Cups. That's what they call Reese's Cups. If you, can only, if you live in Katy and you wanted to come try this, they're here. So good. So, so good. So what's up, y'all? Who is ready to do the keto lifestyle? Who is ready to be coached? Who is ready to be coached? You know, right now, you could be feeling amazing. You wouldn't, you wouldn't even have food. Food would not be making you happy. Food would not be making you satisfied no more. You know what I ate today? I ate a steak. I ate some steak. Not, not the, the real big steak, but a steak. I ate some Brussels sprouts and a little bit of salad, and I'm good. And it was delicious. It was so, so delicious. Guess what? I'm good. People get excited about food. Banana bread is ready. <laughs> um, people get excited about food. People could be around people. They can, hey, oh, you smell something. Guess what? You want it. You look at something. Well, how many times have you had somebody in your office or somebody there? Man, you need to taste this. Oh, my God. Look how good this is. How many times have you ate because you're depressed? Oh, man, I can't believe he did that to me, or I can't believe this is going on, or oh, you know what? You go find escape by eating something. How many times have you been sad? Have you been so sad and you just eat and eat and eat when you're not hungry? It happens to all of us, right? But when I coach you and I teach you and I help you, what I, my, main, my main goal is to make sure you succeed, to make sure... You overcome all these manias. You overcome all these habits, all these, because you smell food, because you want food. I, teach, I coach you to eat when you're hungry, only when you're hungry. You eat when you're hungry. You know, there's this, um, this uh, Christy, I'm coaching her. She came from Weight Watchers, right? And she's so happy. If I'm not mistaken, she's probably lost about, 13 pounds or 12 pounds now if i'm not if I'm, i haven't talked to her so i'm mistaken that because last time she was at 10 so or maybe more I'm, i really don't know maybe she'll come on here but you know her deal was man you know what i i test her out here i said hey you want something to eat and she says no i'm, I'm really full you know and i said do you remember a while back when you wouldn't get full you were ready full but you let your mind you let your 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 in other words you're not strong enough. When you start controlling your mind and telling your stomach, you better keep on growling because you know what? I'm not hungry. We use everything as an excuse. We can just, we just, the little bitty is hungry, the little bit hungry. You know what? There's been times where I'm fasting and it's easy for me to grab something to eat it, right? And I'm okay. I'm going to be okay because I already know what food does and what food don't do, right? And what food I want to take and what food I need to take, right? And, um, and it's so easy for me to eat. But I look at the time and I say, you know what? It's already 930. I'm done. I'm done because I'm just a little bit hungry. Then I told mine, you know what? We're not hungry. We're going to eat tomorrow. You better get full on some water because we're going to eat tomorrow. And I'm good. So that's where I want to get y'all at. That's where I want to get. What's up, Jose? Oh, we, we met last Saturday. Awesome, man. Awesome. 
Um, pleasure here too, bro. Pleasure's mine. So the thing is, guys, if I could help you in any kind of way, reach out to me. Don't be ashamed. Don't be scared. I'm a human just like you. And I've been there. I showed y'all my pictures. I showed y'all how big I was. I showed y'all how unhappy I was. I had straight up bad habits. I ate all day, every day. And that's bad. I would always just find a reason. Oh, it's somebody's birthday. Guess what? Oh, my God. They're going to have food. Oh, I got a DJ. Guess what? They're going to have some food. Oh, man. You know what? I got to cheer myself up, food. I got to do this, food. Man, look at that food. Did you see that? I mean, look at the commercials. Look how they dress everything. Look at everything. Just look how when you go back and buy a Jack in the Box, they have all these pictures and, and all this stuff and everything, right? And guess what? You go over there and you order everything from the menu because you don't know what to get because everything looks good, right? So I want to get you to the point where you're not going to worry about that. Right now, people can pass so pass through here with all kinds of different food, anything in front of me, anything. And I won't reach out for it. Why? Because the cookie I'm eating is filling me up. And it's almost that time. So the thing is, guys, if you want this, you got to go for it. It's not going to come to you. You got to get out your comfortable place. We put ourselves in a comfortable place and we don't want to leave that comfortable place. So today's topic. Don't be afraid to start all over again. Sometimes a clean slate is what we need. That's with anything. That's right now if you're dating somebody and they're, they're an asshole to you. Or if you're dating, if you, whatever it is, right? Whatever the situation is. Wipe your slate clean. Wipe your slate clean and start all over again. Is it going to be easy? No, it's not going to be easy. But guess what? Now you're in control. Now you can go to a higher position. Now you know what you want. A lot of times we've done stuff, we've done it before, and we didn't know we went. Anna, where we at, Anna? How you doing, Anna? We were just talking. I was just talking about you. No, no, I was talking about uh, Christy. But let me know how much weight you lost, Anna, already. So Anna, somebody I'm coaching, and her, and her husband I'm coaching them, and they're doing great. They're doing amazing so shout out to everybody that's out there. Gina, um, there's so many that I'm coaching out there and they're doing great. I see them doing great. Um, if they're cheating, they're cheating on themselves because, again, I'm not around them 24-7. This is only going to work if you want it as much as I want it. And I want you to succeed because if you succeed, I'm succeeding, you know. And other people are seeing this. They're seeing testimonies. They're seeing what's going on. And then they're doing it. So right now, if you're tired of having anxiety, if you're tired of having anxiety, if you're tired of of your health, if you're tired of having some bad health, if you're tired, if you say you're diabetic, say you're borderline diabetic, that means you're this close to being diabetic, say you're type 2 diabetic, um, say you got high blood pressure, if you're tired of all this, then it starts by deleting sugar out your life little by little. You know, I read something not too long ago, and it's always, it stays in my head that some progress is better than no progress. You know, some, shout out to Cynthia, some progress is no better than no progress, you know. What where we at, guys? I, I'm, trying to see, I'm trying to see how long I've been on here. Let me see how long I've been here. Do you know how long I've been on here? I try not to pass 30 minutes. I try not to pass. We just go. I just go at it because I get in the zone and, and, we just, and people learn and we go at it. You know, we go at it. Shout out to Brandy Rick, man. Awesome, man. Awesome. God bless them, man. They... If you only knew their story, man, they, they change, man. Awesome. They, they, they're for the glory of God, man. You know, God is amazing, man. So shout out to them. Shout out to Rick, man. Ricochet, what's up? Shout out to them, man. So, yeah, guys, man, right now, if you want to start all over again, no matter what it is, if it's a job, if, if it's may, maybe, like I just said, maybe maybe your religion hasn't been so strong with God. Maybe you haven't been saved. Maybe you don't know who God is. Maybe you, you get that relationship, but you still don't know. You're not strong with it, you know, and I'm not preaching to y'all. I'm just stating facts. So maybe it's time to have a clean slate and say, you know what? Maybe maybe you've been a, a Catholic all your life, you know, because I, I came from a strong Catholic family and I got out of respect for all my family, but I'm a Christian. So and it's all God. It's all God. Okay. We don't even want to get into that, but it's all God. So maybe it's something that you want to do, then do it. Get you a clean slate and do it. That's all you have to do is just do it and just start all over again. I promise you start all over again. 
it'll probably be better than when you started the first time, you know, because now you're more knowledge about it. Guys, if I could help y'all in any kind of way in the keto lifestyle, please tag me. Please, please uh, inbox me. I mean, inbox me. Call me. I always give my number out, 832-715-2557. For all the people that have been dropping weight, shout out to Ernest. Ernest is at 75 pounds. Ernest is at 75 pounds. Shout out to Raymond, Raymond Mundi, my boy. He, he dropped 80 pounds. Shout out to Mundi, 80 pounds. And I'm going to have them, I'm going to try to have them here. Uh, shout out to Lewis, man. Lewis dropped, I think Lewis probably dropped about 50 pounds. I'm not sure what our 40, I'm not sure what he dropped, but he dropped a lot of weight too. Shout out to him. Um, I'm going to be having a show over here when I do my 100th, my 100th video, my 100th, 100th, 100th video, right? And I'm going to try to have them guys here. If they owe me that, I hope they're here. Shout out to Guzman. Guzman dropped a lot of weight too. I think Guzman's probably at 30 pounds or, or close to 30 pounds. So shout out to them. And these are people that are probably bigger than y'all, that were bigger than y'all, and they're dropping weight and they're staying focused. Shout out to Fernando's and they're staying focused. Guys, man, I don't know how long I've been on here, but I'm jumping off. I appreciate everybody, man. If I can help you in any kind of way, reach out to me, 832 832-715-2557. Order my tea. Order my tea is delicious. Going to help you with any kind of health problems you have. Unstoppable health win. And, I, I, you know, you can find it on any of my sites, on my Facebook. You can find it anywhere. It's trishnati dot, um, dot, uh, yahoo dot shit, I forgot what it was. But anyway, dot com, dot com, right? And um, check them out, man. Uh, pick up the keto. It's, it's called Berry Keto. It's delicious. Berry Keto tea. That's what I'm drinking right now. Berry Keto tea. And, um, Guys, have an awesome night. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I need some more people on my YouTube channel. I got a lot of good stuff over there, guys. Go subscribe to my YouTube channel. Keto is live TV. Keto is live TV. Go to my uh, bakery, sugaristhedevil.net, sugaristhedevil.net. Guys, if you can't remember nothing we talked about, remember, sugar is the devil. It'll destroy the inside of you and it'll destroy the outside of you. I got your treats. Guys, thank y'all. Y'all be blessed. Appreciate y'all Instagram. Thank y'all. Please share my video. Thank you. So we're getting off of Instagram, and now we're getting off of here. Hey, Facebook, thank y'all, man. I hope all the kids are safe, had a great day today, and keep on having great days. All the teachers, shout out to all the teachers. Shout out to everybody out there, all the parents, everybody. Be blessed, guys. Thank y'all. Appreciate y'all. Please share my video. Thank you.